Reef Teats is sponsored by Brightwell Aquatics and Bulk Reef Supply. What's going on guys? Devin from Reef Teats. Now today on Ask Reef Teats, we're answering a question from Nancy. Now Nancy writes in and asks, I've seen your video on applying vinyl to the back of a tank and after a couple of years, how hard is it to remove? Now in my experience, it's actually been pretty easy to peel the vinyl off on a tank. Um, I've done it after having it on a tank for a couple of years and it peels off pretty easy. Worst case scenario, there's a little bit of adhesive on the back which you can easily clean up with a razor blade and a little bit of water. Now worst case scenario, um, I actually did window tinting years and years and years ago. And there's a couple times I had to peel off vinyl off the back of like a deckle on the back of a car that's been on there for years and years. It's all cracking and nasty. And I was still able to get that off with a similar technique. I mean, that was a little more work of kind of working the razor blade, but it still comes off. Now, if you're using a razor blade on glass, make sure you have a new clean stainless steel blade. And as long as it's wet, you're not going to scratch the glass. So aside from that, now if you guys are wondering what the heck we're talking about and you want to know how to vinyl a tank, you can actually check out a video I did a couple years ago and show you exactly how you can vinyl your tank and black out the back. Um, the main advantage of doing that is going to make your colors pop and just make certain things stand out a lot more. Now if you guys want to ask your own question, you can head over to reefdudes.com slash ask, submit it, and I might just answer it on the air. Alright guys, happy reefing. <laughs>